Cheers. <laughs> hey, how's it going? So we are currently in Fairmont Hot Springs. It is July 1st, Canada Day. Yeah. Uh, so we're only here till tomorrow. We're heading out again. But the last week's been pretty busy. Trying to learn a lot of stuff in a short amount of time. But so far it's going okay, I think. Um, I don't know. It's just, it's been a slice. <laughs> yeah. There's been ups and downs and we're learning stuff along the way. Meeting interesting people, learning how to live full time in RV life, you know, doing laundry in the communal laundromat. And, you know, making sure that water in the tanks, you know, not too full. And so it's, yeah. Yeah, it's been, it's been interesting. And, you know, we're, we're celebrating today, drinking some uh, BC wine, which is nice. Little charcuterie board here. Uh, <laughs> yep. Not sure what else to say right now. We're gonna we're gonna give you some footage of the last week or so after this, and uh, you know, kind of see where we're at, and then we'll have more coming next week. Yep, and to our last Canada Day for God knows how long. Yep, it's gonna Cheers. be a while. <laughs> Completed memorial tattoo for Abigail. Thank you so much, Mr. Will, for doing that. How are you feeling, Ty? Not too bad. Sexually Sore? Beaten. Sexually <laughs> beaten. Yeah. <laughs> Things happen behind me. I can't really handle. <laughs> this is Will at Peppermint Hippo for all of you who want to come in for a tattoo and humor. Heavy on the humor. All the time. <laughs> Heavy on the humor. Beautiful morning here in Fairmont Hot Springs, BC. Had ourselves a nice little uh, thunderstorm last night overnight. Cooled everything off. Smells fantastic right now. Trying to adjust to this new lifestyle. It's definitely different from living in the old uh, sticks and bricks, the the four bedroom house with three bathrooms. We've basically got one little space, one bathroom, which you don't always want to use constantly. So luckily, these places have decent enough facilities. 
pretty nice little park overall. I would say it's fairly busy and sites can be pretty close together. I think that might be more just for the pull through sites which we're in. Uh, the back end sites seem to have better uh, spots, I guess. Not quite so crowded, a little better views. But all we gotta do is walk out our door and walk a few feet and we're in the good views anyway, so. Susie's on camera, hiking in front of me. <coughs> I just nailed the bug, I think. <laughs> we were that was lovely. lovely. Some good content there. Going on our first little hike of the season. Apparently I'm not in shape because I'm huffing and puffing. But it's nice and warm out too, so lots of bugs.